All of my adult life, people have become ever more avid seekers of data and information. And the latest hot fad and trend is real-time data, which of course is today increasingly widely available and not very long ago didn't exist at all. And real-time data tells you what's happened now, which is fine if that's what you think you need to know, but as a capital markets investor, it's totally useless uh, for two reasons. One is it tells you what just happened, but the market's always looking forward. The market's always pre-pricing the future someplace in between three and 30 months into the future. And what's already happened is the past, so it doesn't really help you. In capital markets, you always, 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 always need to be thinking future. And then the other part is that almost anyone anywhere can get that almost at the tip of their fingers. And anything anybody can do, if anybody can do it, A, B, C, D, it's been pre-priced because everybody else can do it too. And anything everybody can do isn't worth anything to you in capital markets. So as an investor, real-time data, which is quite a fad because nobody could really access it not that long ago, is actually pretty useless. And like a lot of other market fads, will fade away in terms of people thinking it's important because fundamentally it's not because it misses that feature that the market's always pre-pricing the future and always looking ahead, not too worried about what's just happened. Subscribe to the Fisher Investment YouTube channel if you like what you've seen. Click the bell to be notified as soon as we publish new videos.